Hey guys, thanks for watching Precision Rifle Network. Joel here. So, why are you staring at a game changer bag? Well, on today's installment of Weekend Wisdom, I'm going to show you how to reapply the oil finish wax to your wax canvas game changer. All right, so first things first, guys. I'm gonna take a few of these steps and I'm just gonna tell you about some of them. I'm gonna show you other ones. So uh, let's get started with cleaning the bag. So when it comes to cleaning the bag, um, I'm actually not gonna do this step for you. I'm just gonna kind of show you what you need and tell you about it uh, because my bag's already fairly clean. Uh, what you wanna use is some cold water. You need paper towels and you need some kind of a bristle brush. Um, not real scratchy, definitely don't be using steel brush or anything like that. This is more like horse bristles, um, those sorts of things. A paint brush might work if it's more of a firm paint brush. And what you're going to do is you're going to uh, put some a light application of water on here. It's got to be cold water. Um, I'm not sure why that is. It's just what I learned to do. Um, but you're supposed to use cold water. And then you're going to take your brush and you're just going to kind of you know, do one of these things uh, with the cold water and then you're going to use the paper towels to lightly dab up uh, any of the material that's on there and you'll see it'll come off on the paper towels and it'll be kind of dirty and, and wet. And then at that point you need to let your bag completely dry. Um, it helps to use a hair dryer because, to dry it at this point because we're actually going to need the hair dryer uh, in a later step. All right, so the oil is kind of an important thing. I'm using this uh, this Filson um, oil finish wax. The big thing here is, is you want it to be kind of like a paraffin based so that it's got some water repellency and stuff like that built in. Um, you know, this is made specifically for waxing canvas type material. So that's what you want to get. So again, I'm not going to show the whole process here because it would just literally take forever. So basically what you want to do is you want to get, you know, a good bunch of, of wax here and you just want to start working it into the material. And you want to work it kind of evenly uh, as you go. Um, you can save the corners and the seams uh, for later on or you can just do it all right. Now it doesn't matter what kind of step you want to do at what point, um, but just want to work this in nice and even here all the way along the entire bag. Just work this stuff in. Make sure you really work this into the seam lines pretty good. Put a good amount on there and just put it right on top of the seams. Try to get it done evenly, but you wanna work this in really nice and even. Guys, really spend some time working this in and trying to get it even. Try to pull the material down as taut as you can, nice and smoothed out, and then just work this stuff in. Your bag will appear darker uh, for the time being, but uh, you know not to fear if that if that worries you at all. Um, it does lighten up a little bit. You know, an alternate method of uh, of drying this thing is to put it out in the sun, um, which is what I'll probably do with mine. I'll just sit it out there for the rest of the evening, and uh, it's warm enough and sunny enough today that it'll dry this thing up nice. Now let's assume you've got your entire bag coated with wax and it's time to dry it. You want to use a little bit of heat. You can use a heat gun or just your standard, you know, wife's hair dryer. And uh, you're just going to run that evenly all over the surface, continuing to rub that wax in until it feels kind of dry. It should kind of lose that initial tacky feeling and go back to just a nice soft material. Just as a quick side note, this was a brand new can when I started and that's how much I used coating that entire game changer. It really doesn't matter here. You could use a little more. Um, I don't think you could use any less. Uh, I used um, probably the lightest covering that I could. So you could probably use a little bit more than that. But if you're using you know, an entire can on your game changer bag, uh, you're probably using too much. Congratulations, you have now rewaxed your wax canvas game changer. Thanks for watching today, guys. Hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned for more great videos.